Looks like we have proof that distant relatives of elephants used to live in Ontario, Canada. Whoa. Researchers say they finally confirmed the discovery of blood residue from a now extinct mastodon on an old stone tool found on the Hamilton Escarpment. Oh my God. Dozens of stone tools like spear points and hide scrapers were found in an area along the Red Hill Valley. A newly released research paper in the Journal of Archaeological Science says the tools were likely used by the first human occupants of Ontario who moved into the area at the end of the last ice age some 13,000 years ago. Because I think this is Pretty cool. Mastodons look similar to modern elephants and are believed to have lived in herds and were predominantly forest-dwelling animals in North and Central America. A full-length trailer for Oppenheimer, Christopher Nolan's upcoming film about the retelling of the invention of the atomic bomb, is out. I don't know if we can be trusted with such a weapon. Choice. Killian Murphy stars as J. Robert Oppenheimer, the leading theoretical physicist of the Manhattan Project and father of the atomic bomb. The new trailer finds him pondering a nuclear future. We imagine a future. And our imaginings horrify us. The film will move between color photography and black and white and is currently set to hit theaters on July 21st. Tom Cruise took time out from his busy daredeviling schedule to say thanks for making his movie Top Gun Maverick the biggest film of the year. I didn't want the year to end without thanking you all for coming out to the theater. In the video, Cruise can be seen free falling across the sky, all while giving thanks to audiences for allowing him to entertain them. I'm running out of altitude, so I better get back to work. We gotta get this shot. You have a very safe. And happy holiday! We'll see you at the movies! The sequel to 1984's Top Gun was a hit among audiences and critics alike, grossing nearly $1.5 billion worldwide and has generated some serious Oscar buzz. Three, two, one. Cruz also shared a video that shows the seventh installment of the Mission Impossible series, Dead Reckoning Part 1, will see him take his death-defying stunts to new heights.